next it's a UFC women's bantamweight division matchup. All right, so here she is back making the walk here tonight. Her takedowns certainly are the best in this division. So explosive. Her technique is just outstanding. And Joe, there's no telegraph. Even when the opponent has prepared and seemingly feels like they know what's coming, she will shoot from far out, still get in on those legs, and still get you exactly where you don't want to be fighting off of your back. As scary a takedown artist as we have in this women's division. This girl has outstanding speed and footwork. Very difficult to catch, very elusive, and very good at closing the distance and landing her own strikes. She is absolutely terrifying on the feet because of this. Good to see this young woman back making the walk to the octagon tonight. I will be surprised, Joe, if she gets put on her back here tonight. Her takedown defense, arguably the best in this division. Great balance, solid base, beautiful sprawl, very quick with her feet. And for a lot of women, they spend so much time trying to get her down and fail that they don't have much left offensively when you hit the latter rounds of the fight. Gotta try to outstrike this woman tonight. You're probably not taking her down. This woman has frightening knockout power. Absolutely thunderous power behind both her punches and her kicks. She is a real threat to knock anyone out in this division. All right, just about ready for live action. Here is tonight's tale of the tape. Both fighters are 20 years of age, and they have the same height and reach. All right, now for the particulars, he is Bruce Buffett. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. When the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Dan Mergliata. This is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the Saitama Super Arena in Tokyo, Japan! It's time! Five rounds in the UFC Bantamweight Division! Introducing first. This woman is a mixed martial artist making her professional debut here tonight. She stands 5 feet 9 inches tall, weighing in at 135 pounds, fighting out of Salvador Bahia, Brazil, the Destroyer! And now introducing her opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This woman is a grappler making her professional debut here tonight. She stands 5 feet 9 inches tall, weighing in at 135 pounds. Fighting out of Stockton, California, Golden! All right, grip the rules in the locker room. I want you to obey my commands at all times, protect yourself at all times. Want a nice, clean, safe fight. Touch gloves, to back your corners, come out fighting. This has been one of the most highly anticipated matchups for a long time. And ladies and gentlemen, strap yourselves in, because it's about to go down right go now. It. We are underway. That's, again, the experience. Well, she went to the straight left, unable to connect them. Beautiful jab. Beautiful jab. Sharp timing. Oh, she tagged her with a right hand there. They're both... Oh! This could be it right here. Oh, straight right. Well, she got clipped by that hook, Joe, and she is a sitting duck, and she's gonna stay in her opponent's striking range. She's gotta get on the tip of her toes, circle away from the power shots, and move those feet. Oh, man! This could be it! And now starting to snap off that jab! Now go 
goes in and secures the takedown. Postures up. She's showing good defense here, controlling that arm. Beautifully executed sweep. She's working for the mounted crucifix. Trying to stay heavy here as best she can. She's moved into side control. Oh, good punches from the top here. In full guard. Oh, well played there as she gets back to her feet. Two minutes to go. Strong straight left there. Good exchanges from both fighters. Working on a single leg here. There's the single. Excellent movement and transitions here on the ground. Staying busy. Oh, that was a hard one. Excellent movement here on the ground. Trying to stay heavy here as best she can. And again, look at that. Punch. Double underhooks. How about that chin? Oh, very nice leg kick there. High level stuff. Slightly deflected. So we crossed in 30 seconds. Oh! This could be it right here. Oh, huge shot there. Didn't quite connect. Bell, that marks the end of the round, and we'll see if she can recover from getting stunned by that huge shot just before the horn. Of course, you know she's only got 60 seconds here with which to recover. They'll get her on the stool. Physically, she's compromised. Mentally, can they keep her in this one? Let's see it one more time. Hey, she's a good striker, okay? You got caught. It's all right. This round, I want you to start off moving. Brittany Palmer is in the building. You ready? You ready? It's all right, fight. round two. That last round was an all-out brawl. If they continue like that in this round, someone's getting knocked out. Oh, she blocks the punch. Nice jab. The Superman jab. There's a kick. Joe, nice job moving that head off the center line as she slips to avoid that right hand. Trying to move into side control here. Denied. Oh, keep it busy here off of her back. Nice offense from the bottom. Excellent movement here on the ground. The elbow lands to the head. Excellent movement on the ground here. Constantly moving, constantly staying busy. She's now established side control again. Excellent movement and transitions here on the ground. Staying busy. Beautiful sweep. Very nice sweep. She winds up in guard. Well, she was a little bit hesitant in round one, but she has certainly picked up the pace here in this second round. It took her a while to find her range. She's in a strong striking rhythm now. Good job there of avoiding the clinch. Clean oh. punch. Oh. This could be it. Big shot. Oh. Cut to the head. Big body, body shot. shot there, too. Oh. And really starting to make these shots count. Well, she gets up again here, but she looks compromised, Joe. She secures double underhooks here. Oh, 
Underhook here. Oh, she's got double underhooks. Battle for position here. Back to over under. Big shot from the bottom. 30 seconds to go in round two. Right hand upstairs. That one hurt. In on a double leg takedown here. Good takedown. Hey. And the horn sounds on round two. Stop, stop. Let's take a look at it again here. Great finish in that round. Great finish in that round. Listen, how do you feel? You feel good? She's hurt. Jenny Andrade to get us going. You ready? You ready? Third okay. round underway. All right, so she continues to land a high number of strikes here, just like she did in the previous round. As efficient as any striker in the division, this is a world-class display of striking here. Oh, beautiful! This could be it right here. She might try to finish this fight here. Oh, big left hand. Oh, big left. Oh. She's trying to stay heavy here as best she can. And lands a good shot. Continuing to stay busy here on the ground. Excellent movement here on the ground. Well played for her there, Joe, as she escapes back up to her feet. Again, she chooses to clinch here. Pummels in and double underhooks. Oh, now she's got that tie clinch. Appreciable damage could be coming. And there comes the separation now. Takedown attempt there. Gets the single leg takedown. In half guard position. And got full mount. She executes a very nice sweep and winds up in guard. Lands a good shot from the bottom. Nice elbow as well. And back to full guard. Oh, and with urgency, she is back up again. Oh! Oh! Big right hand! Huge right hand! She's out! She's out! Great punch for the KO. Yeah, that was just a beautiful shot by her there to end the fight. I'm not sure she could have drawn it up any better than it played out here tonight. She lands the seminal blow there midway through the round. I'm not even sure her opponent saw it coming. So, big, big... All right, we go back inside the octagon to the veteran voice once more. He is Bruce Buffett. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Mergliana has called a stop to this contest at 3 minutes, 30 seconds of the third round. Declaring the winner by knockout. Well, she's got all the tools, Joe, and she certainly put them to good use tonight as she gets the win and gets so with style points by way of the knockout. No judges needed for this one, and you can be sure her bankroll is going to be fatter on Monday morning. She'll probably get a bonus. At the very least, though, the celebration is on. You see there with her coaches and her teammates, nothing better in all of pro sports than to win.